Masks have been mandatory in most places during the pandemic, but big news yesterday, the CDC saying masks no longer required indoors for those who are fully vaccinated. But that doesn't mean all businesses are already ready to go maskless. In fact, today the governor reminded everybody that Connecticut businesses can still ask customers to wear them. Use your brain. If you're unvaccinated, you're in a crowded area. Maybe if you're at the Warner Theater and you're not vaccinated, we ask you to wear the mask. But that it's a guidance. Our chief political reporter, Our chief political reporter Susan Raff is live in downtown Torrington. And Susan, what are some businesses planning to do? This is obviously a very tricky situation. It is tricky and probably a little confusing. And I think that the overall feeling from the CDC's announcement is that people are hopeful. They feel that things are getting better. And some of that optimism certainly can be felt here on Main Street in Torrington. More businesses are reopening and more people are feeling comfortable about going outside and inside. But it really depends on where people go. A lot of people are getting vaccinated now. So yes, they feel more comfortable, but it really depends on where they're going. Take, for example, this museum, Kids Play. It's here on Main Street. Now, more than half of the kids who go here are under the age of 12, and that is an age group that hasn't been vaccinated yet. So they're going to require that masks be at all times and all places here. The Warner Theater, which is across the street, they're going to reopen next week, but they're also going to require that people wear masks when they come. Now, coming up on Eyewitness News at 530, you'll hear from restaurant owners and customers about how they feel about some of the changes and whether they want to wear a mask or not. We are live in Torrington, Susan Rapp, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.